This is Ernest Sparkman broadcasting live from Leslie County from the Richard M. Nixon Recreational Complex that is to be dedicated here by the former president of the United States, Richard M. Nixon, who is to come into Leslie County sometime this afternoon. And we're broadcasting now at this moment from the new uh, recreational complex, which is a beautiful building that uh, the carpenters and the construction people, the concrete men, are still here. They're even uh, out front pouring concrete, so they're working like beavers, and I'm sure they'll be working uh, throughout this evening and night to get this uh, building prepared for the dedication. There's uh, huge rolls of carpet uh, on the floor that have not been unrolled or unwrapped yet. So I see four American flags with gold eagles uh, pierced on top that are still in wraps on the stage, and the stage from which uh, the former president will speak is approximately 20 feet to our right. Uh, we're speaking to you from a three-tiered podium, so to speak, that has been built solely for the press, for the uh, networks. ABC uh, is here, uh, CBS is here, NBC is here, U UPI, Associated Press. And I even noticed uh, a phone here uh, that says Night Rider News, whoever that may be. So the uh, press is here in, in great numbers. Downtown Hyden, as we drove through a few moments ago, is filled with people already at this early hour. Uh, traffic already is beginning to be a problem. County Judge Muncy's office is a madhouse uh, because we tried to get in there and uh, there was people lined up apparently trying to get passes to get into this event. Uh, certainly this is a town of excitement. It's uh, sort of like uh, the feeling of, that one gets when you go to a carnival already. The hammering in the background is the gentleman to my left here from ABC who's setting up his lighting system. Uh, and uh, so the security here is unreal. Uh, we had even trouble getting in here today to set up the broadcast equipment. Uh, you have to have a pass uh, to do anything and everything. In fact, uh, I almost began to wonder whether or not I'd have to have a pass to get out of here to go back home this evening. This is Ernest Sparkman reporting from Leslie County for WKIC News.